Today I got an email from a viewer named Joe. Joe said that he and his wife are getting ready to take the required training courses to get their concealed carry license in their state. Now in his state, he says the price for this class varies widely. It depends on who you take it from. It can cost anywhere from $40 a person to hundreds of dollars a person for the same class. And he asked me if I had any opinion on which class he should take. Would he get more from the more expensive classes or should he just take the cheaper class? Now, before I go into answering his question, let me reiterate my own personal opinion about the whole tactical training craze. You know, the opinion that has made me so very popular with the entire tacti drag community. The one that gets me uh, not invited to all the really cool guy gun get togethers. And that is that I think it's pretty much overblown. It's nowhere near as important as people make it out to be. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not anti-training. I think training is invaluable. I just don't think these classes are as indispensable as some people try to pretend they are. For example, let's look at two different guys. Both of these guys are very interested in firearms and learning how to use them in the best possible way they can. The first guy looks up everything he can find on the internet about how to use your gun, scenarios you should train for, etc., studies those videos, and then twice a week he goes out and actually practices every week. And then the other guy, he just saves up his money and he takes one of these expensive weekend courses every three or four months. Well, at the end of a year or two, the guy that used the videos and went out and trained every week is going to be far better than the guy who just went to courses every, you know, every three or four months. He's going to actually have been practicing the art. He's going to be learning more. You're not going to learn much in a weekend course. Uh, doesn't matter how tactical it is. If people really learn something in just a weekend, well, then college would last about six months. Now, I'm not disparaging training. In fact, I'm saying the opposite. I'm saying training is the important part. The class is just the gateway. And if you don't use it as a gateway, if you use it as training, you're not getting anything out of it. What I think is the most valuable part about the whole training courses, it's not the whole tacty drag thing. And a lot of people say, why do you call it tacty drag? Because it's just the same thing as like a drag show. These guys love their costumes. You know, they love playing pretend. About the only difference between some of these classes and a drag show in Vegas is that there's fewer wigs and most of the guys don't have to tuck their penises. Uh, and in some cases, I mean, they don't really need to tuck their penises. Uh, so that's really why I call it tacty drag. But let's face it, if you don't practice outside the course, the course isn't going to do you much good. Now, there is something to be said for that one-on-one -on -one personal environment, although it's never really one-on-one. -on -one. It's like 30 students and an instructor. There is something to be said about that personal interaction where you actually see someone who is an actual example to you of like, hey, I want to be like that guy. I want to be able to do the things that guy does. That inspires you to train more outside the class. So that is a positive thing. And that is important. And it used to be far more important when if you didn't take one of these courses, you'd never see any of this stuff. You never would learn any of these things. But nowadays, we live in an age where you can learn all of this complete with visual representation videos in the comfort of your own home. You can learn anything you want to learn and then take it out and put it into practice. Believe me, someone my age in their 50s really appreciates this because we remember, you know, trudging our way to the library, going through the card catalog and looking something up and trying to learn something and there being very little information there even. So you should really appreciate how you can learn everything you need to learn just from videos and putting it into practice. And a lot of people out there are gonna be like, you're not gonna learn nothing from a video. Well, if that's so, well, why do all these guys make videos for you to buy and tell you how valuable they are? So uh, that doesn't really make any sense. But let's get back to actually what I think about the tactical training. Like I said, it's very valuable if you use it properly, if you use it as an inspiration to go out and practice what they preach. If you get in the class and you go, man, even if it's tacty drag galore, and you go, this is fun. And then you go out later after you get home and say, I want to go see if my local range has a group that actually does this. Maybe they compete, they have competitions, etc. They have matches. You get involved and you actually do it. That's where 
Training is the most useful. These training courses that you go take for a weekend, like I say, they inspire you, they're fun, they teach you what you actually wanna go out and learn. You don't learn to be a master carpenter by taking a class or any number of classes. You learn to be a master carpenter by getting the basics in like a training course and then going out and doing. And that's the way you learn with a firearm. You get the basics in a class, you get inspired by the class, you find out how much fun it is in the class, and then you go outside and actually do it. And in today's society where you can find all that information without actually going to a class, if you're self-motivated enough, that class isn't necessary for you. But like I say, for most people, maybe because you're not self-motivated or you actually like the camaraderie of being in a group, classes are awesome. But when it comes to concealed carry, I don't think classes are necessary at all. I don't think they're valuable at all for a regular concealed carry person. If you're just someone who wants to just be a moderate user of a firearm who can handle it safely and carry it every day, I don't think you need a class. I've never seen any evidence that the classes do any good. They're just basically a rubber stamp that the government makes you get before you exercise your rights, and I don't really agree with them. I don't think you'll get anything from that class that you couldn't get on your own if you're really interested. And if you're not interested, if it's stuff you don't wanna know, you're just gonna to go to the class, get the stamp and move on anyway. So it really doesn't matter. So the real value of these classes, the full tacti drag academies that down to the little concealed carry courses is basically how much you take from them and what you want to do with the information afterwards. The class themselves are pretty much irrelevant. It matters what you do with the information you get. So I don't believe in requiring training, period, because you can get all that information on your own if you really want to know it. So my advice to Joe and his wife is take the cheapest course you can find and take the most from it that you can. Then go to your local ranges, see if there's any groups you can join that you can actually shoot regularly. You can join up with uh, groups of people that get involved in matches, etc. You can actually get some practice. Then go to a local Second Amendment organization or a local concealed carry organization. Find out about the law. Let them give you some information on what you can do, what you can't do, what you should do, what you shouldn't do, and take that stuff to heart. Actually learn it. Do those things. Those things are far more important than actually taking a class. Just get out there, use the information that's available to you, and actually use your gun. And I think that's the best thing you can do, far better than spending a lot of money on a class. Uh, cool kid gun show things, uh, which I really don't get... And he asked me, which one does he, <sighs> a viewer who says that he and his wife, so popular with the tacti grat, <sighs> uh, you know, big tracty, uh, tacti, <laughs> fuck, god damn, that said he and his wife are getting ready to take the retrot, retired, cool guy, uh, gun get together stuff. So. Why can't I get this fucking rock? So my advice to Joe and his wife is to... Damn it. Uh, Mavis, hush. Uh, it was the uh, FedEx guy at the door. And I know you all can't see that from there, but it is from CZ USA. Ooh, a little box from CZ USA. I wonder what this can be. Well, we'll see in a video very soon, hopefully. And if you're one of my Patreon supporters, you probably see today.